guys, it's Haley, aka Stevie's Haley, and welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to a new video. Okay, hi, it's Editing Haley. I literally just filmed this video, and now I'm editing it, and I just realized that I said hey guys, instead of hey everyone. And I feel like it's not, you know, a Haley intro if it's not hey everyone. I'm really sorry, hey everyone, it's Haley. <laughs> That's what I meant to say. Um, yeah, okay, bye. So, as you can see by the title of today's video, we are doing a desk tour. I'm so excited. I love my desk. I say this in every desk tour video I do. Um, I just love being at a desk. So, my desk has always been like an important little area in my room, and I really love my desk this year. Make sure to check out my dorm room tour. I'll put it up in the cards. I still don't know which side it's on. Oh, another thing before we get started. I also have already filmed this video, but I just got a tripod, so I'm refilming it, so yay. And last thing, I promise, yes, I do have a new uploading schedule. I am uploading Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, Mondays are vlogs of my week. Wednesdays, I'm doing like real-time study with me's, and then Fridays are like, the random other videos like this one. I hope you guys enjoy and let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so this is my desk area. It's currently a little rainy today, um, but I have it in this corner of my room and I think it looks really cute. Last year I had my desk facing like the window, but this year I decided to put it against the wall so I could like put stuff, some stuff up on the wall and I really love it. And yeah, let's go ahead and get on into it. So of course right here we have my Ikea cart, and this isn't really too school related, there's really nothing school related on here, but I think it's still nice. I have my diffuser up here at the top, I have this little Katherine Johnson Barbie doll, and then I have this little fake plant that I think I got from Walgreens. Right here on the edge I have this little thing that says love you to the moon. I think this is supposed to go in a car, but I don't have my car here up at school, so yeah. <laughs> so then we get onto the second like little compartment and this is kind of where I keep like more desk stuff. I have all my sticker sheets in here. Let's see if I can open this with one hand. Yes, I can. Um, they're all in here. So things like my um, Daiso stickers, these are from Lacoma. So I just keep those there. I keep all of my box stickers in this little box. Also like my loose stickers. I also have some soft clay from Daiso. You're gonna find out really quickly that like most of my stuff is from Daiso. I love Daiso, so. I have this little jar with my diffuser oils. I have a few cords in here that I use. Um, this is an old glasses case. In here I just have a bunch of random little knickknacks. And then in the back we have my favorite peach gummies. These are from Daiso. They're really good. I'd recommend them a lot. I also like the watermelon ones, but the peach are my favorite. And then right here I have this jar like container thing from Target. I have a lot of like extra random pens, black pens that I use for notes and things. I have a couple blue pens. I don't really use like these blue pens anymore, to be honest. But then I have all my like my colorful kind of stuff. So all my Muji gel ink pens that again, I don't really use anymore. I just bought the um, Zebra Sarasa pastel pens. So I think I might give these Muji ones to my sister. I think she'll like them. I also have these Pilot Friction highlighters. Um, I'm not using them right now. <laughs> Um, I have so many highlighters that I like to rotate them like every semester, so I used these last semester. So right now I'm not using them, so I'm putting them here. And then in the back I have all of my Tombows. I don't have too many. I would love to get more one day, um, but I just have a couple. I have two packs of these gel pens that I got from the dollar store. So that's kind of like the stationary kind of area. Just like extra pens, stickers, and kind of miscellaneous stuff. So then down here I have kind of my art area. I embroider a lot. Um, this is kind of a bad embroidering that I've been working on, but I have a couple hoops, some cloth. I have a bunch of thread down there, and here is thread. This is thread. I have watercolors, some more watercolors, and a sketchbook. And then yeah, that's just kind of my little art area. I come here whenever I'm stressed. 
Um, I also journal a lot, which is why I have a lot of stickers, so I always put like stickers in my journal or my bullet journal. I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm a, I'm a pretty crafty person. <laughs> okay, so then here, of course, we have the desk. I'm gonna kind of start in the drawers and then go around, um, just because I think the drawers are kind of boring and I don't want to end on a low note. So first of all, we have this first little compartment drawer area thing. Right here, as you can see, I keep all my binders. They're empty right now because we haven't like gone through like any test yet. I have my first exam for my biology class in a week, so once I'm done with that, I'll put all of the material from the first exam in here. I, that's kind of like how I organize everything. I keep everything in my folder until the exam and then store them in here. I do need to change this math one because I dropped out of calculus. <laughs> I'm gonna take that next semester. I just, I couldn't do it this semester with organic chemistry and biology. I feel like a lot of people can, but I just, I wanted to focus on these, these two classes. So anyway, and then right here I have my notebooks. I use these to rewrite lecture notes. So of course I have molecular cell biology. Um, it's pretty early in the, in the semester, so I haven't like done a whole lot. Um, I also have organic chemistry. This pink one I use for my English class. I haven't labeled it though because I'm going to end up using it for scratch paper because I am not going to fill this all up. Like I just know I'm not. And I have an extra one which I don't think I'll use because uh, the class that I dropped calculus for doesn't really, it, we don't have any tests, we just write papers. So I don't really need to rewrite lecture notes I feel like. So I'll have an extra notebook for next year which is nice. In the back I have some goggles that I'm not using this semester because labs are online unfortunately. Um, this bag I take with me wherever I go. It has hand sanitizer, hand lotion, it has my headphones, some hair ties, and also my eye clicker. Um, and I just keep that here and I grab it whenever I leave. And then, of course, I have printer paper. Um, I only use white, like, plain paper for notes. I don't use lined paper or, like, grid or anything, so this is kind of my supply. <laughs> and down here I have a few more school things. I have my folder that I mentioned. This is where I keep all of my work for everything. Then I also have my laptop case, and then I also have a clipboard which comes in handy, um, actually, because sometimes lecture seats are like pretty tiny, so it's nice to have like, a hard surface to write on. And then right over here, I have a ruler and then this jar with like a bunch of command hooks and binder clips. And that's kind of what I keep in this little area. So kind of the more functional things, um, of course, the cute stuff I keep like <laughs> up on the top and in this drawer that I'm about to show y'all. So as we can see, it looks a little messy, but I promise it's organized. All these containers are from Daiso. Again, I love Daiso, so... If you have any questions about where something is, probably assume it's from Daiso, but you can always ask in the comments if you're interested. Um, so first of all, right here I have my pencil bag in easy reach. And I'll show y'all what's in this when I do a backpack tour, so stay tuned. In this little container, I kind of keep the miscellaneous things that I use quite a bit, so like a stapler, uh, nail clippers, I have ex some extra lead, this cleans your laptop. This bigger container, I have one stab oil highlighter, um, I have the pa pastel ones and I'm using these for this semester, and I'm not using the orange because I'm only taking four classes so I didn't need this color. And then in here, I just also keep a bunch of expo markers and some tape. So in here, as you can see, I have all of my washi tapes, which I know are not necessary, but I love washi tapes. But then, of course, I have all of my sticky notes, and I have so many. I love them. I kind of collect them, if you will. These are my only plain <laughs> page flags, but I like them a lot. Um, I have some cats, some bunnies, pandas, penguins and seals. Oh, more pandas. These, these were the first, like, page flags I ever bought that were cute. <laughs> I bought these, like, freshman year of high school, I think, or sophomore. And then all of these are from Daiso. These cat ones are also from Daiso, but these big ones are from Daiso. And then these are also from Daiso. And then I also have these little, like, envelope card things that I got in, like, a memo set, again, from Daiso. Um, and I just keep them back there. So then the last little, like, section in here, I have all my Stabilo, no, my Stedler Triplus Fine Liners um, that are fun to use. I have some Aleve because I get headaches every now and then. I have my filming schedule that is not right anymore because I changed it. <laughs> but then I have all my sticky notes. I don't really buy sticky notes anymore. As you can see, I buy a lot of sticky tabs, but I don't really buy sticky notes because 
Um, to be honest, I don't really use them a whole lot. And then in this little container, I have push pins and like the small binder clips that I use for my cork board. Back here, I have a small calculator. I have some textbook cost because um, I just wanted to see how much I spent on textbooks this semester. <laughs> um, and then I have some index cards that I have back here that I use to make flashcards. So yeah, so that's kind of all like the fun stuff, the little knickknacks and everything that I love to use. Um, of course, these all aren't necessary, like you don't need all this stuff, but it makes me happy. <laughs> so then I have a hole puncher here, which comes in handy all the time. I have my headphones that I use, they're noise cancelling, which is really nice. And then back here I have my calculator. I have this little notebook that I made. Well, it's from Muji and I kind of made it into a study tracker, but now I just use it for scratch paper. I have this little pad of grid, like sticky notes, which is kind of fun. Um, and then I have these little knock-knock stationary pads that I use quite a bit. I kind of just break everything down into like section so it's really nice. Um, more knock knock. I have a little, another little memo pad. I love memo pads. Um, and then I have another knock knock stationary one. I, I'm almost done with that one. I think I have like two sheets of this. Yeah, two sheets. And then I have like three sheets of that one. I go through memo pads pretty quickly so I have a lot. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna get onto everything that's at the top of my desk. Minus my flashcards. So over here you can see I have like my pins and a bunch of stuff. So I got this container, can you guess, from Daiso. So then I also have this little Einstein figurine that my mom got me. And then in the drawers I have some glue that I use in whenever I glue things in for like my journal or my bullet journal. And I have all these notepads that I love. These are all from Relacoma and I got them at Daiso. I use these all the time to make to-do lists and everything. And then lastly, in this little drawer, I have more highlighters. My friend gave me these as a graduation gift, and I think I'm going to use these next semester because um, I haven't used these yet. <laughs> then, of course, we have my mild liners, you know, the whole study tube, study gram aesthetic. They're all just in here, kind of in rainbow order. And then behind the little drawer set, I have this little like list of things to do. I got this idea from Cheyenne Barton. I saw it in a vlog of hers. And so I just made a list of little things to do that can make you happy. I have this little water coloring of like a bonsai tree that I did. And then right here, I have this drawer that I got from the Target dollar section. Um, and in here, I just keep all of my stationery that I don't use as often. I have some extra zebra sarasa pins, scissors, a few brush pins. These are really cute. These are some mechanical pencils that I got from Daiso. And then right here I have this little tray from Daiso. <laughs> um, I keep lip balm on here. I keep this little keychain that I got from Daiso. I'm starting to sound like an ad from Daiso, but I love Daiso. Um, but I, this is Neko from Sumiko Garashi, I think. Um, and he's really cute, so I just keep him here. And then I have some hand sanitizer, some rocks that I got in a rock shop, and then this little domino with a picture of my mom and dad. So as you can see behind the desk, I have string lights. These used to be over here. However, I decided to kind of move them here because I thought that looked cute. They're hung up with like binder clips, but um, I mean, it works. They look really cute when they're plugged in at night. So right here, as you can see, I have my laptop with all of my fun stickers. Um, I have sisters in STEM, Mrs. or Mrs. Doctor, hold on, let me overthink this, Science Lab, Microbiology Coffee Co, Ace, Pride, and then a mole. <laughs> I have a little laptop stand. I have the name in the description box if you're interested. I don't remember it, but it's from Ikea. And then up here we have my little cork board. I have a little butterfly that I made. I made a bunch of these butterflies over lockdown and they're just kind of all everywhere. And then I got this cork board from Daiso. I just have a bunch of little random things here. And then this is kind of where I keep like to-do list and things that I need to do. I need to change my county so I can vote because we don't, we don't stand um, Donald Trump in this channel, so. And then over here, this is the last section. This is kind of a cute section as well, I feel like, but I have right here taped up a list of meal ideas because sometimes I like impulse eat so I'm trying to think more like I'm trying to think a bit more about like what I'm consuming um, and then right here I have my school schedule for this semester 
And then in the back right here, you can see I have a whiteboard with a few little like magnets. And I haven't used this yet, but I know it's going to come in handy when I'm reviewing for organic chemistry, so I just keep that there. And then back here, as you can see, I have three little notebooks. This one is my journal, but then I have my mastery. Um, but then, of course, I have my bullet journal, and it looks really cute, I think. It's very, like, cottagecore-esque. And then right here, as you can see, I have a little plant. Um, their name is Petunia. There's another one that's growing somewhere. Um, my nail is disgusting, sorry. Um, there's another one growing. I don't know where she is right now, but she's somewhere. But that's Petunia, they're great. Of course I have my lamp right now, it's shining light on Petunia. Um, Petunia is a lavender plant, I don't know if I mentioned that, but it's shining light on Petunia because there's not much light outside today. And on the lamp I have some lotion and then also a hair clip. And then I have my water, which is in my Starbucks cup that I always drink out of. And then last but not least, I have a coaster, which is really cute, it has a bunch of cacti. And on top of it, we have my mug, which says, it's not rocket science. Oh wait, yes it is. I got this from NASA when I did a scholars program there a few summers ago. Anyway, that's everything of, at my desk. Of course, we have like my chair with my signature cardigan. I'm just so happy that I'm able to have a space where I can work and be productive. Okay, so that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I love my desk, so I really hope y'all liked it. My hand is still so shaky, even with a tripod. Like, this is why I ruled out med school. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah, that's all I have to say. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure to subscribe if you're interested at Life of Texas a and Because I do go here, and I do post weekly vlogs. Um, and now I'm posting real-time study with me. So if you need, like, a study buddy for, like, 30 minutes or maybe, like, an hour, I do post those. Um, so those will start going up. And then on Fridays, I post fun videos like a desk tour. Make sure to subscribe if you're interested in that. And yeah, that's all I have to say. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!